All right, in this video, what I did is uh, I got two water bottles and uh, I cut the top off of this one. This is the negative and this is the positive. I connected it uh, with a, about an inch PEX tubing here. So the water, when I pour it in, it goes down and goes in here and goes over to that one. Uh, as far as the connection goes, they're, they're at the very bottom. Uh, the, the caps screw on and the bolts are going through the middle. I drilled the holes and then sealed them with this uh, automotive uh, gasket sealant here. Uh, the only problem is the connections aren't really that good. So as you can see, it's still making the oxygen. Let me zoom in. You can see the oxygen being made and it's going up to the top here, which I, at the very, very top, I cut us slit right there so the whole the air can come out and here I have the same plates as I have in my other videos the washers stainless steel washers uh, and you can see it's making uh, hydrogen here so in length you have about from here to here you got about four four and a half inches in length and uh, as you can see down you see the hydrogen being made. The only problem is I couldn't get a very good connection with my my uh, washers there. That bolt you see there and the one underneath of my plates, you have to tighten them down really, really, really tight so that the plates get a good connection to the bolt. And I couldn't do that because my pliers don't reach that far down in there, so they're they're probably not really even touching onto the bolt. Uh, but this is just the concept design. Before I go out and spend money on uh, some other stuff like PVC, if you can just, uh, I had to cut this top off to get the washers down into there. Uh, but if you can use like a PVC uh, and you can screw a cap on here and then put a nozzle for the hydrogen to come out and then put a nozzle over here to vent the oxygen out that way, it could work and you could also put the connections instead of straight on the bottom like I have done as you can see here uh, was not a very good design in, on my part um, because you can't really get, get a good connection but if you like put it up on the, to the sides here to the right and maybe to the left and have some kind of connection you could snap into there then it would be uh, a lot better design, but this is a prototype design. Uh, let's see if you can see the PEX tubing. You can see the PEX tubing right there. Focus it. And it goes through to this side. You can't really see through the bottle there, but it comes out there on that side. But even with the bad connection, uh, I'm still making hydrogen. You can see it coming up. So once again, uh, I'm happy at the success of uh, being able to split these two. Uh, now I can come up with a better design. Uh, I'm not worried about this producing too much because uh, this is just a concept to see if this idea will even work. To see if the water will be able to carry the uh, electrolyte through from one bottle to the other bottle. And it does, so I'm happy about that. Uh, I've had a lot of people tell me that I'm not putting that much uh, hydrogen out. Well, I'm not trying to put out a lot of hydrogen right now. I'm just trying to see if I can split these two. And I can. So then when I make my uh, final design, and then I'm just going to fill this up with plates uh, or, or stainless steel washers. This will be all stainless steel washers, and this won't. And uh, this might have two or three washers, but it won't have as many as the hydrogen side will. And then this will have a cap or something. Uh, I'm still in the process of making that, but this is just an idea, a concept to see if the idea works, and it does. And I'm documenting in case anybody else wants to try this idea themselves and uh, email me back or show me their video and see how far they've come. But uh, like I said, I'm just interested in making a hydrogen. And that's what I'm doing. 
as you can see it being made right there. Alright, thanks for watching and uh, leave me a message or post a video.